what what advice would you have for uh, anyone getting into this industry, whether it was uh, you know on our side as a as a manufacturer's rep or uh, contractor or you know facilities manager, building engineer? What what advice would you have for them if they were starting out? I think the the number one, and it's part of our core value structure. Uh, one of the words we use is resolve. Um, I think you have to have a little bit of resolve. You have to be in it for the long term. It is a great career. Um, it's not glamorous like you're going to run out and make a million dollars in a minute. Um, you have to understand the business that you're getting into is a lifelong business, and you'll meet a number of friends. So, so my advice to uh, young people or new people getting in the in industry is to invest. And what I mean by that is, is you have to jump in with both feet no matter what job you're taking. You should give the most of yourself all the time, otherwise you're cheating yourself and your customers. You're going to be away from your family in any job. Invest in that job. Make sure that the time spent away from your loved ones is well worth it. There's got to be a great buy-in. The, the industry is fantastic. You, you meet great people. I've been able to travel the world because of the industry. I've been to almost every state in the United States. I've learned technology. I've learned everything from how to run a boiler to fix a pump to uh, do marketing um to <laughs> yeah. you know what a p l means uh, so you don't look at this industry and say i'm gonna sell pumps the rest of my life or i'm gonna sell hvac equipment or i'm gonna sell panels the rest of my life you're really investing in the trade and the people that you're in and so you need to really learn whatever industry you're in to hone your craft and to to build relationships to take a minute and that's investing right mm -hmm. you, you basically if you invest in somebody else they're going to invest back in you and the more you invest the easier it gets the more relationships you build and with experience sitting here for 30 years i can tell you now some of those folks are retiring that taught me and i had the opportunity to rehire one of those folks because he he just loves the industry mm -hmm. and it's been fantastic and and now he's watching me lead him so it's come full circle um but i always have those voices in the back of my head so those relationships and and advice you get um if you invest in them they'll last last you a lifetime 